Good morning. Day two of Washington DC starts right now. Um, I am meeting some of my classmates down in the lobby. We've got to hop an Uber and get over to campus. As you can tell, this is a little more serious than my normal day. I've actually got a collared shirt on. I also have dress shoes on. Uh, it's weird, it's different. I'm not used to wearing dress shoes and dress shirt anymore. So um, we're heading off to class. There's a brief orientation this morning and then we jump right into it. We're going to see the Special Olympics today. Oh wait, I don't know if I'm allowed to talk about that yet. Uh, screw it. So I don't know what I'm gonna be able to film of everything today, but I'm gonna take you along for whatever I can. So let's get downstairs. Is that in focus? Oh, okay, there it is. Whoa, what a day. I am just back to the hotel room. It is 9 o'clock. The last time we spoke, it was 7.30 in the morning. I didn't really have any time to film at all today. Um, it was just constant, nonstop school. Talking about the data, learning some more stuff about uh, the subject that I'm studying in school, touring Special Olympics facilities, and just overall getting to know my team and the rest of the people in my program. Um, just got back from dinner. I am gonna head down to the bar real quick, have a quick beer with my team and some of my classmates before I hop in an Uber and head down to H Street. Uh, see, this is the last chance that I've got to see some of our friends before we move. We move in nine days and I wanna try to make the most of it. So. I should be going to sleep. Uh, I didn't sleep worth shit last night, but I want to see our friends. So I'll take you along to see friends. So let's get out of here. I'm just getting down to 8th Street right now. It's about 10 after 11. I really wanted to be here about an hour ago, but I got caught up hanging out with my team, which was really awesome. But now I'm gonna try to dip in, see some friends for a little bit of time before I gotta get back to campus because I gotta meet my team at 7.30 tomorrow morning. And I wanna get some sleep, so I'm heading. Just getting back to the hotel. It's 1.30 in the morning. Um, I have to meet my class in six hours. Um, I still think it was well worth it to go out and see my friends. Um, they're amazing people and it's always great to see them. Got to see some people I haven't seen in a long time so but I'm gonna go pass out now and get up for class early in the morning. So um, let's pick this back up uh, tomorrow. Good night. Good morning, it is Saturday morning. It is day two of the school immersion that I am in, uh, in the middle of. Um, it's about 7.20 in the morning. I got home last night late, um, and as usual, I didn't sleep well because, well, I just don't sleep well in hotels. So today's gonna be a long day from my understanding. We've got, we've got to finalize our presentation and everything that we are giving tomorrow, so Waiting on some classmates, we're gonna Uber down to campus and then kick the day off. I'm gonna to try to do a better job of taking you around with me today, but um, as usual, I got no promises. But uh, let's see where this goes today. Whew. I thought yesterday was a brutal day. It is 11 p.m. and I just shut my computer off. Um, we've gotta present our findings tomorrow and our PowerPoint isn't done. Um, our data analysis isn't done. Uh, so we've been burning the midnight oil. Well, not really the midnight oil because it's not midnight yet. But I've gotta be back at class or at school tomorrow at 7 a.m. So I've gotta kinda of call it a night and hopefully we're able to finish everything up tomorrow morning when we're all back together and be able to present this and knock it out of the park. So. That's it for me, I'm done for tonight. I'm not even taking you back to the elevator, I'm not taking you back to the room. I'm going to bed, good night. 
morning. I'm uh, back in my hotel lobby. It's 6.41 a.m. Uh, it's day three of this uh, weekend immersion here at, at school for me. Um, I'm exhausted. I mean, I don't know if you can see it, but I'm just, I'm just beat. I haven't slept a good night in the three nights that we've been here. I was up really late last night working on our presentation, trying to finalize some things and polish some stuff up. I have to meet my team at 7 a.m. on campus, so it's a little earlier of a morning than uh, than the last few mornings, but it's all over by three today. Um, we present and then watch some of the other groups present, and then and then that's it. Uh, it's been a good weekend. It's been a stressful weekend. It's been a different weekend, but. It's all over soon, and I will do my best to take you with, maybe give you a little show of campus or something like that, but I know I haven't been talking much or vlogging much. It's just been school, school, school. So let's kick this day off. So all that is just some of the stuff that we've got to get on our presentation today. We've got 10 minutes to present on some data for Special Olympics, and we are finalizing that presentation this morning. Um, it's now 7 a.m. I just got into the building. I haven't had cl uh, class. I haven't had coffee yet. Really need coffee. I'm waiting on my team. Hopefully they'll be here soon. We can knock this out and make a go at it for today. So this might be all I show you today. I'm not 100% sure, but I will do my best to show you some other stuff. So I'm gonna go get to work now. Um, it's 10 after seven. Uh, my team's still not here. Um, we were supposed to meet at seven, but um, they must be running late. So I'm gonna run out and uh, get some coffee. There's a Starbucks on campus down the street down the block, down the street, down the quad. It's over that way, so I'm gonna go get some coffee. Yeah, that's not good. Starbucks is closed, the general store is closed, the bank is closed, Subway is closed. Um, I really need coffee. This is a nice campus. Uh, this is way, way up northwest in D.C., uh, nearly to Maryland. I'm actually closer to Maryland than I am to everything that D.C. is known for. Um, I've never really spent much time up here. It's, it's pretty cool to actually be on campus because I've also never spent much time on college campus as a student. Uh, last time I was on a college campus as a student was back in the 90s when I was getting my associate's degree in automotive uh, mechanics. So it's kind of cool to be here. Um, kind of cool to check out the campus. It's really kind of quiet and, uh, well, it's quiet because it's 7.10 in the morning. So let's, uh, let's head this way. Let's go check out something else in the campus. So it's not a really big campus. I am standing in the middle of the quad right now, and there's, you know, a half a dozen, dozen buildings uh, for various activities, but this is it. I mean, it's kind of a really cool, quiet area. I, it would probably be fun to hang out and study here in the summertime, but right now it's uh, 31 degrees, so I'd love to show you more of the campus, but I'm cold and I'm going back inside.
Whew. The practicum is done. Uh, practicum, not practicum. I keep saying it wrong. It is done. Uh, at least the first portion of it is done. I, it went. It went stressful. It went. It went. It went. It went. Um, but it's good to have it over. Uh, I got to do it again in 10 weeks, and now it's get home. So I'm gonna go have a beer with some friends, and then it's off to the train station so we can get back to New York. Okay, that's uh, that's it. It's uh, 10 p.m. on Sunday. My school stuff's done. Um, got to have dinner with some friends. Kind of sit down and relax, catch back up with Shayna. And now we're back on the Amtrak train and we are headed back to New York. I think we get in at like 1.40 in the morning and then it's a half an hour to 40 minute train ride back to Brooklyn. I'm hoping to be in bed by 3 a.m. So, uh, thanks for following along. And until next episode, uh, have fun. We'll talk to you soon.